Hi there, good afternoon. This is Ethan Cole with Alderman's Toyota, and this is the 2024 Land Cruiser 1958. This is finished in Meteor Shower. It has a 2.4 liter four cylinder iForce Max hybrid engine making 326 horsepower, 465 pound feet of torque. Up front, you get the Toyota Heritage grill, circular headlights, fog lights, and some parking sensors. I really like the square grill that we have right there. This features a full time four wheel drive system. So you're going to have all wheels spinning at all times. Uh, you have 6,000 pound towing capacity on this vehicle and you also get a couple nice features such as crawl control and multi-terrain select. But not only is this vehicle ready to go off-road, it looks sharp and looks the part as well. You have these nice graphite wheels with a Yokohama all-season tire on the outside of it. Smart key system on this vehicle. So lock and unlock the vehicle just by keeping the key in your pocket, pressing this button right here. Those uh, mirrors fold right in. Tinting along the back window. Now these vehicles are entirely made in Japan, so that's another cool thing about this. Up top, you can see you have the roof rack crossbars. And uh, let me go through and show you how you unlock the vehicle. Just key in the pocket, unlocks just like that. Uh, but I wanna show you the rear lift gate and everything, so unlocking it through there blacked out handles on the vehicle. In the back, you have some more black accents. Land Cruiser badging is blacked out. Toyota, blacked out. And then iForce Max, right there, hybrid. Um, you can do this with the vehicle. Press this button right here. A little bit of a lift gate in the back here. Rear glass. You have more cup holders, a couple charge points. And then uh, all these seats fold down incredibly flat for more storage. Venting up top on the roof as well, and the rear cargo mat. And of course, Toyota branded first aid kit, which anyone and everyone should have. <laughs> uh, and here you have your wall outlet, which is nice to have for plugging things in on the trail. That goes right back down. Tailgate goes right up. There you have your tow hitch receiver. Here's another cover that you put on when you have the, the tow hitch on the back. In the back here, you have a little bit of storage. You can kind of fit some things inside there. Uh, let's go through, close this up now. All closed up. Really like the way these tail lights look as well. Fabric seats in this vehicle. You have some nice, easy to clean door cards. Black fabric seats with this really nice pattern that's gonna hold you in grip you nicely. These seats fold down incredibly easy, just like this, as you can see, all entirely folded down. Easy access to the back. And then down flat, so you can have kind of this like set like that, or whatever works best for you. A little bit of recline on this as well. So, this is my driving position. All weather floor mats inside this vehicle, and look, you even have those little uh, door sill protectors. In the back here, you see you have pockets for the maps back here. Climate control for your rear passengers. Some charge points right here. Two USB Type-C chargers and your normal uh, little charge plug-in. Change the climate control back here. But check this out. Armrest, really nice, really comfortable. In these seats, in the back, you kind of sit a little higher up. Theater-type seating, nice and comfortable. One of my favorite features from back here you can see you have the wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto on that multimedia panel right there. Automatic climate control, heated seats, and heated steering wheel. And then the off-road features such as the downhill assist control and crawl control. And then you have drive mode selects um, over here. Have your different four-wheel drive modes and a rear differential lock and that uh, center differential lock as well. Really comfortable soft touch materials here. I like the gray stitching to kind of match those seats. Let's hop on up to the front seats now, shall we? Also venting above right there and in the back as well. Coming up to the front seats now. Key is in my pocket. Fabric seats again on this, nice bolstering on the side, manual adjustable seats. Uh, hop it in, you got a grab bar here. Closing the door now. Push to start right there. Got a pretty nice display right here with your tachometer, completely customizable. You can select all these different options right here. Just to kind of 
swap out different things, see what you like the best. Really high quality uh, display right here. And of course, dual zone automatic climate control. So I'll set it for uh, 70 degrees. Bunch of charging points down here. Right there is your USB tether. So if you wanted to use wired Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, you have the ability to do that through here. Let me clear this out as well. So really high quality reverse camera right there. Nice to have. Then you have your parking brake built right in there and the brake hold function and decent amount of cup holders as well. Um, I really like the way this vehicle looks. I'm gonna turn on those lights so we can get a look at the way they're gonna show up on the front. And you have an integrated trailer brake controller right down there for any towing that you may be doing. Tinted rear windows on this vehicle. Those tail lights looking really nice and sharp. I like the square outline on them. There's your exhaust down there. What a rugged and sharp looking vehicle. You're gonna get 23 miles to the gallon combined. That's 22 city, 25 highway. It's kind of nice. You got the illuminated door sills on here, which I forgot to point out, but those illuminate, say Toyota. Kind of neat. It's beeping because I have the key in my pocket and the vehicle's running. Let's show you the way these headlights look. So you have a uh, LED light right there, circular LED ring light, and then you have your high beams and low beams built right into that. And then down below you have your fog lights right down there. Really nice, aggressive looking front end. I prefer these lights, I think, these circular ones to the normal Land Cruiser. All right, that's gonna do it for me. If you'd like to learn more about pricing and availability of these Land Cruisers, I'll leave a link down below in the description to our website where you can find out more about that. Or come on down to Alderman's Toyota on Route 7 South here in Rutland, Vermont, and take it for a test drive. I've been Ethan. Thank you so much for watching.